Hello everyone. Welcome to my YouTube channel, Dr. Akif Beg. Today we'll be talking about croquetage sign in ECG. So croquetage sign is nothing but it is defined as the notch near the apex of the RBF of inferior leads 2-3 ABF seen in patients with ostium secundum type of ASD. So this is the ostium secundum type of atrial septal defect. It is the most common form of the ASD. And in this patient, uh, you can see generally based on the, if the more is the larger is the defect or larger is the shunt, you can see is the you can see a notching in the inferior leads that is 2 3 AVF. You can see RVF, they can see an extra notch you can see here, and that is what is called a stock attack. You can see here notching at the tip of uh, R wave, you can see notching here in the lead 2 3 AVF. It is suggestive of rocketage sign and suggestive of uh, ostium secundum ASD with a large uh, with, with a large ASD and a good amount of left to right shunt. So there is ECG features of secondum ASD is characteristic feature is rocketage sign. Other than that, there will be right axis deviation because the blood is going from the left off side of the heart to the right side of the heart. More blood is going to the right side of the heart, so there will be dilatation of the right right atrium and right ventricle which will lead to uh, features of right axis deviation, right ventricular hypertrophy and right bundle branch block. You can see here, this is a croquetage sign in lead 2-3 AVF, so notching near the R wave, you can see here in root to 3 AVF. And after uh, ASD closure, you can see here that the notching has completely disappeared. So disappearance of croquetage sign occur after ASD device closure. So this has a specificity of around 92%. If it is present in all the inferior leads, so suppose this thing is present in all the inferior leads, that is 2, 3 AVF. So it will, in, even though you don't know the echo or even though you don't have examined the patient. So if this sign is present, then you can say but that, that suggests you that 92% of uh, times it may be correct that the patient may have IASD. It correlates well with the degree. It also correlates well with the degree of left to right shunting and the size of the atrial septal defect. So after closure of ASD, this sign disappears in 35% of the patient, whereas it may remain persistent in remaining of the patient. So this is all about the croquetage sign, which is an important uh, diagnostic clue for uh, diagnosing ostium secundum ASD. Hope you have liked this video. If you have any queries, you can test me in my comment box and do share and subscribe my YouTube channel, Dr. Akif Beg. Thank you.